I'm going to show you how to wrap the handle of your Remo drum with some deer skin lacing. So I use the soft side up when I'm wrapping it. This is about 42 inches long. It just makes it feel a little better versus the plastic and the raw rope. So I start the first strand, just cinch it in here. Now when you wrap it, keep the soft side up. So this is the hard edge. This is more soft, feels a little better on your hands. And when you wrap it, you just want to make sure you cover this end part so it's not showing when you're done. When you're wrapping, just keep it, always keep it snug. Always keep pressure on it. Maybe go around this maybe four, five times, and then you can start going out on one of these. Legs of the handle. I usually wrap it enough so I can at least cover that small end of it that was showing. And kind of reinforce that with the other bits that you'll use. That's probably good for that. And just kind of find a strip that kind of naturally goes to after you're done wrapping and just keep it snug. Always keep it snug so when you're done it will stay. Yeah, just make sure it's right next to it. You don't want to overlap it, just keep it straight against the edge of the last wrap. Just kind of pull it snug and make sure it's right against the edge. I'll show you how to tie this to the end, but when you're going around the center here, just, like I said, maybe four or five times. And just try to, when you go around the wrap, just try to cover places where there's plastic showing. Try to get all that covered so it's a little easier to hold on to. So just wrap it around once, give it a good tug to tighten everything down. When you get to the edge of this, just try to keep it really close together so it's, nothing's gonna show. Once you get about this much or so left, you want to go ahead and tie it off. 
and I do two knots. Just kind of hold this so it doesn't unravel past the point where you're going to tie the knot. Just so going to keep the soft side up. Just kind of pull it down so it's still all together. I'm sure there's better ways to do this. I'm just showing you how I do it. Sometimes I use just some pliers to kind of pull this a little more snugly. And I, I'll get some pliers and kind of pull that down later so it's a little snug, but that's pretty much it. And I usually just leave it out, but can, I guess you could always trim it so it's a little closer to the edge. And just do the same thing with each thing and I'll show you what this looks like when I'm done. Okay, so, so far I've gotten four of these done and pretty much all of this plastic ball in the center is covered except for one little strip which is right here underneath. So after this point it's just basically wrapping enough to cover the end of this so it's not showing and then just continue wrapping. So when you're wrapping you can't really tuck this in the edge like I did the first part. Kind of hold this. Kind of pull it really snug to hold that in place. And you just want to keep this ball in the center small so it's a little easier to hold on to. So you don't want to wrap it bunch of times in the center just trying to cover the first time I did it I covered it a lot and I made the ball pretty big so you want to do about four or five each time and you'll you have it will be covering it all eventually so just be confident that you'll be covering it all when you're done so yeah for these last two just make sure you cover that couple times. I always keep this really snug. And then I'll show you how this looks like when it's all done shortly. Okay, I just finished up a minute ago and here's the final result here. As you can see this is pretty, fits pretty well in the hand. It fits good, feels good. It's softer than just the plastic and rope. And here's some other ones I finished. Just different colors. And this is mine right here that I use and I these Remo drums come with these drumsticks. And I just kind of took the top off and recovered it in some deer skin and used that same material to kind of create a handle for it. And this is just sinew wrapped and then super glued to keep it in place. And that was helpful. I don't know if you have any questions.